Hi, and welcome again to Annie's Angle and Annie's Kitchen. Today, we're making pumpkin muffins. I love pumpkin muffins. It's, it's not only healthy for you, the muffins, it's delicious. So come along into my kitchen and let's make pumpkin muffins. I'll tell you what you need. Before I do, grab a cup of coffee. And pumpkin muffins go excellent with coffee, believe me. Pumpkin and coffee, ooh. I tried that ice cream, pumpkin and coffee ice cream. It's excellent. So what you're gonna need are eggs, two eggs. Now I get organic, I'm using organic pumpkin. I'm gonna use one of these cans, the pumpkin puree organic. Uh, you're gonna use baking soda and baking powder, cane, cane sugar, all purpose flour. And I'm gonna use the organic canola oil. Pumpkin pie spice, a little bit of that, and a dash of nutmeg, and a, and a teaspoon of cinnamon. So these are the things that we're going to do to make a delicious pumpkin muffin. And if you like, you can, now I'm going to add raisins to mine, because I love raisins in it. You might not. You might like walnuts. You might like nothing in it. But these are very moist, delicious, and healthy. So, you know, you can give your kids, you can meal prep them and freeze a whole bunch of them and have them when you want. Heat them up in the oven and, woo, delicious. So come on into my kitchen and let's make pumpkin muffins. Woo! So we'll do the dry ingredients first. We have our two cups of organic flour we're going to use. One teaspoon of baking powder one teaspoon of baking soda, a half a teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, a half a teaspoon of, a little less than a half a teaspoon of nutmeg. I'm going to put in there and two Half, half teaspoons or one teaspoon of cinnamon we're going to add to this and then we're going to mix that around like so Ooh, it goes all over and then we're going to come back oh I like that it smells really nice so we're going to come back we're going to put that aside and then we're going to add our red ingredients. Okay, so now we're going to crack our two eggs in there. One, ooh, two. And we're just going to whisk that around a little bit. That's great. And then we're going to add our canola oil, a half a cup of canola oil and a half a cup of sugar. And then our pumpkin, we're gonna add it in there. And we're gonna put that all around this whole can of pumpkin I'm gonna use. And we're gonna mix that around really well and keep adding that pumpkin. I love pumpkin. It is so healthy for you. Pumpkin is full of vitamins. And then we're going to add that, we're going to fold that in slowly to our dry ingredients. And just very slowly keep adding that. Whoa! Spoon wants to fall. And you want to do that until we come back and I show you how it looks. You just keep folding it in. So this is it. It's all mixed really, really well. I mixed it excellent and I added raisins. Now I love raisins, so I added a lot of raisins to this. And I put a little canola oil in each, each cup here. And then I'm going to add my ingredients to this pan and uh, put it in the oven for about 30 minutes at 350. 
and we'll see how it comes out. Now these have been in the oven for 30 minutes and they are done. As you can see, I put my knife in there and it comes out clean. Aren't these beautiful? Beautiful pumpkin muffins. So, what a treat. So let's take them out of the oven. Right up there and show you. Aren't they aren't they beautiful? So we're gonna we're gonna take a taste of these delicious muffins right now and I'll let you know how they are. So it's time to take a taste. Come on, take a taste with me. Did you make yours? You know this pumpkin, nothing is going to go to waste on this pumpkin. You can make pumpkin seeds, you can cut this open and bake it and have it as a side dish. You can take it and cut it and make take the puree out of it and make pumpkin, your own pumpkin muffins. You can do so much with a pumpkin and it is so, so healthy. So get your pumpkins today. This happens to be an organic pumpkin. But, you know, pumpkins have thick skins, so sometimes I'm not that crazy if it's not organic, but I do like to get organic whenever I can. In fact, next year we're going to make a pumpkin patch in the back of our, in our yard because we have a little farm out there and we're just going to add pumpkins to that because I love pumpkins and they're so good for you. So come on and take a taste with me. You have to have this with coffee. Oh yes, look at how beautiful that is. Isn't that beautiful? Mm. With coffee? Mm. Mm. It is so good. And as I said, pumpkins are very versatile. You know, you can make use the pumpkin puree, the pumpkin seeds with some salt and olive oil. Ah! Oh, my God, it's delicious. So, like this video, subscribe to my channel. And for those of you who have subscribed to my channel, thank you. I really appreciate it. Come again, we'll be cooking up a storm. And I do a lot of other videos, so hope to see you soon. Enjoy your day. Bye-bye for now.